every, every car that you took me around, Jay, you knew every story. You knew the engine, you knew the owner, the history, the significance, chassis, gearbox, horsepower. Some say that you, you know more about cars than most historians. I want to know where that passion came from. Well, I don't know if that I don't know if that's true. I mean, I you know what you know. It, it's what I it's what I enjoy, and I enjoy reading the history of the automobile. Um, but you're rural Boston, right? And and you're and you're growing up. Were you, were you into cars as a kid? Yeah, I lived in a rural area about 20 miles south of the New Hampshire border. So, you know, it was different back then. Boys are expected to know how to fix lawnmowers and snowmobiles and go karts and that type of thing. You know, you could. I remember when we were 11, we found a uh, Renault 4 CV and we had three and a half acres behind our house and we fixed up this car and we'd, we'd drive around the backyard and, you know, my mom would watch from the, the window, you know, you know, she's doing dishes or something. She just watches and we just drive around in circles and do stuff boys do with, with an old car. I mean, now, of course, uh, the car would be taken away. My parents would be arrested. Arrested. I'd be and foster care because they <laughs> to drive a car. But, but, but back then it was just a little bit different. You know, it was, uh, you know, here's how different it was. I think the high school had a gun club. <laughs> oh, <laughs> you could bring your BB gun or a 22 and put it in a locker. And afterwards, they, okay, those days, that's just fire a few rounds in the back. Happen. Yeah, that's never going to happen again. But, you know, it was just different. The whole mindset of everything was just, was just different. I mean, my mother knew nothing about cars, but she knew when her Valiant didn't start to open the hood, take off the round thing, stick a screwdriver down the skinnier round thing to keep that flap open and then try to crank, you know, nowadays cars are pretty bulletproof. So nobody really needs to know anything other than just how to start it. You know?